Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to my channel. I'm Natalie, and today we are watching Black Panther. Welcome back to my channel, everyone. Thank you so much for being here, and welcome if you're new. Today, we are diving into a movie that I uh, am highly anticipating since it came out in 2018, and that is Black Panther. I really wasn't expecting to meet him in Captain America Civil War, so that completely surprised me when we saw him in that movie and uh, has been hyping me up ever since to watch this one with you guys for the first time. It is definitely sad knowing that Chadwick is no longer with us in this physical world. It's definitely sad to be watching this movie for the first time and he's no longer with us and still able to create art and beautiful stories. Uh, he's a great actor. We've visited 42 earlier this year on my channel for Black History Month and I got to be more familiarized with his work that way and I'm really excited to see him again as Black Panther in this movie. It's definitely a bit sad but I am happy that he is able to be memorialized in such an awesome movie and one that I know meant a lot to a lot of people. I'm really excited to be watching it with you guys for the first time here today and to have you guys share your experiences with me when you saw this movie, share things that maybe I missed when watching this for the first time. That's kind of what I love about watching these Marvel movies with you guys because you always educate me on the things that I miss in the comments down below in like a very passionate awesome way like I can feel the excitement coursing through the comments when I watch Marvel movies so um, it's really fun and I'm really excited to be diving into a new character even though technically we have met Black Panther before I'm excited to see a movie where it's all about him and his people I'll be interested to see if we're continuing with the same timeline like going in the future from Captain America Civil War so where Bucky's in Wakanda and that's where we're at with his father having passed away or if it's going to be going back in time and maybe we'll get to see more of his father. I am curious to see what they do with that because some of the other movies we've bounced around a little bit time-wise. But real quick before we jump on into this movie, I just want to mention that I do have a Patreon page for all of you massive Marvel fans. If you want to catch my full-length reactions to everything we watch over here on this channel, just make sure to go down below, click that link to Patreon, and you just have to have your own copy to sync up along with me. Also make sure to follow me on my Twitter and Instagram where you can catch exclusive posts that I don't do anywhere else, as well as get notified about when I post here on this channel. But that's pretty much all I have for this intro, guys. I'm really just excited to jump on into this movie. I know it's a completely new character other than seeing glimpses of him in Captain America Civil War. I think it's going to be fun and I'm really excited to see what they did with it and how they made this film. So if you're ready, grab a drink, grab a snack, and let's get into the movie. A plant that granted him superhuman strength. Where are we if he's telling the story of home? But the Jabari tribe isolated themselves in the mountains. Oh, we already have a conflict, I see. To keep Vibranium safe, the Wakandans vowed to hide in plain sight. Ooh, smart, smart decision. Yeah, where are they? Are they in America? I was wondering, where is he telling the story from? Oakland? Why? What's that? Hide the straps. He thought it was the cops? But it's, it's the thing up in the sky, it's the spaceship. Did they come here to this apartment? The UFO people? Are they aliens? How did they get here? Oh my God. Ungabani. Prince Njobu. You just show up in his apartment and say, who are you? <laughs> oh! He, this poor dude is like, I didn't sign up for this. Is this Chadwick's dad? How was home? Not so good, Ndagwet. Oh, baby brother, oh. Ulysses Claw. Oh, I recognize this guy. Yeah. Was he the guy that worked with Ultron or no? Was it somebody else? There's so many people in this Marvel world. And tell me why you betrayed Wakanda. It was him? Whoa. You think you'd recognize one of your own people, man. Like, you wouldn't ask him to do this when you met him? Is he seeing the ship in the sky? So, we gotta move forward in time eventually, right? Present day, here we go. The death of its monarch, King yeah. T'Chaka. Yeah. Prince T'Challa. Okay, so that's his name, T'Challa, and his dad was T'Chaka. Just don't freeze when you see him. I never freeze. What do these little ball things do? Are they bombs? Oh, did he just take control of all the vehicles? Oh, that's cool. Defense position. Are we under attack? Yes, if he says defense positions, you're probably under attack. What is she doing? What is she gonna do? Oh, she's so sneaky. Oh, she's a badass fighter, huh? Nice. Wallahi, I will shoot her right <laughs> Oh, good thing this came down yes good job girl because you froze when you saw her which is the one thing she told you not to do i will be crowned king tomorrow i wish for you to be there 
Oh. That's it. No, I'm sorry for your loss. Ugh. Watching all these movies that take place in all over the world, it just makes me want to travel again so badly. That's pretty cool. Okay, so they're they're like using some kind of crazy force field magic to hide their city. And look how integrated their city is with nature. I love this. Okay, I thought Asgard was the prettiest place I'd, I'd seen in the Marvel Universe. I think this tops Asgard. Just because of all the trees, man. I love trees. Oh my God, I've totally had a choker necklace like that before. <laughs> Can't wait to see what kind of update you make to your ceremonial outfits. <laughs> I like I shouldn't even have to turn around, man. Now we're in London. Oh my God. I'm just checking out these artifacts. Oh, Michael, what's up? His hair looks so cool here. Fula tribe, I believe. Nah. Nah? But it's from Wakanda and it's made out of vibranium. They have vibranium in their, in their museum? How do you think your ancestors got these? Or did they take it like they took everything else? That's a good point. Is she okay? Is she dying? What's happening to her? But you ain't checking for what you put in your body. <gasps> Did he just poison her? I think I... she might not be feeling too good. Oh, she, she, is she a part of the operation too? She seems to be paying attention. I'm gonna take a break. Yep. Oh, she works here. She's infiltrated the institution. Please. <gasps> oh, Michael B. Jordan, you're on the wrong side. Oh no, it's a shame. Oh, she bypassed the cameras. Oh no. Michael B. Jordan, you're the villain? Oh, it's totally the guy from Ultron because he lost an arm. Okay, great. I'm so glad I got that confirmed because I knew I recognized him. Yeah, that's dangerous. A man like this should not have a, a hand that's a weapon. You're not telling me that's vibranium too, huh? No, I'm just feeling it. <laughs> He's just feeling it. Okay. Oh, we get to watch the ceremony. This is cool. This reminds me of uh, those waterfalls in Zambia that are like, forget the name of them. Oh my God, I've been there. It's like a natural wonder of the world. Tallest waterfall in the world, I think. Oh my God, they use the waterfall like an amphitheater. This is awesome. Whoa, is it? Oh my God. Oh my God, what's happening to him? What the f did he just drink? Is it that herb? That was intense. He recovered quick. <laughs> if any tribe wishes to put forth a warrior. Oh, oh, so if they can kill him, they can take the throne. I feel like somebody's gonna challenge just for fun. Is the fifth tribe gonna come in? The ones that retreated to the mountains? He's gonna have to fight one of them. Ugh. Who could not keep his own Father, safe. Oh, you're gonna get killed. You're gonna get killed, man. Leader of the Jabari with- I accept. Ooh, I like that little cutoff there. I can't believe they're fighting <laughs> on the edge of a waterfall right now. Oh, they're getting closer to the edge. Oh, that's the tradition. <laughs> oh, the mask came off. Oh my God, this is high stakes. His mask is gone. He doesn't have his shield. <laughs> he just got speared near the heart, man. What the f this is gross! Oh my god! Now yield. I don't think he's gonna yield. Uh, Whew, I was nervous. I just get nervous when people are standing on the edges of things. Good job, T'Challa. Whew, he really had to work for that. <laughs> I love that like all of his uh, soldiers that are a part of like his group are all women. That's so cool. What is happening? Oh my god. Is this the rest of the ceremony? He's gotta do this. Oh, the flower. Flower shaped like a heart. Doesn't seem like it's shaped like a heart to me. It seems like it's shaped like something else, if you know what I mean. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. And take you to the ancestral plane. Man, this guy's had to go through a lot today. Oh God, now they're gonna bury him? Are you kidding me? This is awful. Oh God, I really would hate being buried like this. Oh, whoa. Oh, wow. Oh, wow, that's pretty beautiful. There's literally a panther. Or there's three panthers. Four. Five, <laughs> six, never mind. I'm gonna stop counting. <laughs> oh, oh, oh God, this, this is making me so sad right now. I am not ready to be without you. Oh, that's really sad, yeah. This hits deeper knowing that Chadwick's not here anymore, man. It's actually really sad. <sighs> I came to support you and to honor your father, but I she, can't. She has missions. She has a purpose. She's got to drive. I've seen too many in need just to turn a blind eye. Oh, is her mission saving people? What would you have Wakanda do about it? Share what we have. Oh, oh, but you, they can't. Oh no, I forgot to grab more tissues. So this is the last one I have here. That's, this is not going to cut it. Why does he have a rhino and a pen? Rhinos are not meant to be tamed, man. Is he, is this his rhino? My king. My love. Oh, that's her love. Claw plans to sell the vibranium to an American buyer in South Korea tomorrow night. I will bring him back. So he's insisting on going by himself 
or maybe just with his women that help him. He's already got so much conflict as a leader. It's interesting that like the love of his life wants to has so many aspirations to help all these people by doing the one thing that Wakanda has tried to keep hidden for all these years. So he's got this massive conflict of trying to help those in need, but also trying to protect his people. Who are you taking with you to Korea? Okoye and Nakia as well. You sure it's a good idea to take your ex on a mission? Oh, they're exes? That makes sense. And what are these? The real question is what are those? Oh my god. Oh no, they didn't. They did the shoe meme. Oh god. That dates this movie. <laughs> oh, that's so cool. Wow, there was purple when that lit up. Purple really was the right choice. You're recording. For research purposes. Is that her taking a video? Oh my god. They're so high tech down here. <laughs> Delete that footage. <laughs> Man, I would love to get into a club like this just one time, but I am so not cool enough and I don't have high clearance anywhere. I don't know what kind of tables those are, but I, I was getting flashbacks to Casino Royale for a second. Just spotted an old friend who works for the CIA. Hey! Oh, he recognized him too. You are buying from club. Do me a favor, stay out of my way. This isn't the United States, dude. Oh wow, he brought a lot of dudes with him. Oh my God, they're they're setting off the security and they just it doesn't even matter, they can go in anyway. Oh! <laughs> I can do a deal with you by myself. Thank you very much. <laughs> He's like, they're not here for you, dude. They're here for everybody else. I feel bad for all these poor, innocent people that are just enjoying a night out with some gambling and some wine. I mean, they all gotta get the f out of here. Really? That's where you hit it? You labeled it fragile. This guy's crazy, man. <laughs> Oh, no weapons allowed in here, but she snuck that in, no problem. I guess vibranium doesn't trigger the alarm. Oh my god, innocent civilians, run! Oh my god, her heel is a weapon! And I like that this dress she chose to wear still matches the same color of the outfit she's normally in. Oh, I forgot, actually, never mind, I forgot about his arm. I forgot about his arm. Oh no, Nakia. Oh no. Do we just leave him? He'll catch up. He'll catch up? Oh! She's gonna drive it? Oh my god, she's so smart. She's on it. This is awesome. She's very fearless of the bullets hitting her. Oh wow. Holy <laughs> It's a little concerning though that he's not going after Klaus. It's them. I'm a little worried. Because Klaus does have a really scary arm. Wow, she really is a badass. Oh my god. Nakia's fine. Nakia's fine. Okay, good. Oh! <laughs> He just happened to be right there. That's great. Just right around the corner. Hey, get on in. I forget the name of that actor, but I'm pretty sure. Is it the same guy? He's done a lot of comedy. I think he was in like the British version of The Office. Oh, whoa. Oh, God. Everybody run. Everybody, all the civilians, get out of here. Watch his arm. <gasps> yes. Yes. You got to bring him back, though. But he's in my custody now. He's not going anywhere. Oh. Oh, is he? He's in your custody? <laughs> huh. I'm going in. <laughs> yeah, this is definitely the same guy from the Cornetto trilogy in the office in, in Britain. But what I am interested in is that arm cannon. Oh yeah, me too. Where did you get that? You're telling me that weapon on your arm is from Wakanda? <laughs> the vibranium is, but, or maybe it's from Michael B. Jordan. Shepherds, textiles, cool outfits. Oh, they placed an earpiece on his thing. They're so good! And you stole all their vibranium. I'm surprised that he doesn't buy this considering what he's seen Black Panther do and the fact that they're even here right now and fighting with high tech. Like, wouldn't you piece it together? The Claw stole all the vibranium you had. Claw. Oh, Claw is his name. That's so funny, because, you know, Claws. Oh god, here they are. Oh no. Oh god, oh no. Oh no. Oh Jesus, that suit is really amazing. Oh no. He, he knows who it is. He pieced it together by that ring, didn't he? That weapon got him. Oh my God. What about Nakia? What happened to her? He just jumped in front of me. What? <gasps> oh no, it's him. Oh no. Oh, he saved Nakia's life. We can't save him. If you take him to Wakanda? Oh God, this is breaking a big rule though. Oh, I don't know how this is gonna go over, especially cause he's part of the US government. Great, another broken white boy for us to fix. Wait, who is the last one? Bucky? Is that who she's talking about? For 30 years, your father was in power and did nothing. With you, I thought it would be different. It, 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 uh, 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 but it's more of the same. 
It's been literally one, it was one time. Wow, that's kind of rude. I'm not gonna lie. Like this guy's been escaping for 30 years for a good reason. He's pretty good at, at evading. I think that was unnecessary. You don't wanna go there, boy? Yeah, I do. Drop it! Sorry, Eric. It's gonna be okay. <laughs> He just killed her? Why? Why Why did he shoot? Why did he shoot all those people? I'm so confused. Michael B. Jordan, you're savage. Check these out. Each one is for a kill. Whoa. That's a lot of kills. <laughs> I just don't get why he killed, why he turned on them randomly after helping him escape. It's a shame that he killed the girl he supposedly loved too. Just establishing how awful his character is. What happened to my alcohol? Oh. There was a man today wearing a ring. I identical to this oh one. Oh my god, is Michael B. Jordan his uncle's son? Is it his cousin? I promised the king to say nothing. I am your king now! That's true. You better tell him. He's literally phasing off with him. It's relevant information. Your uncle fell in love with an American woman. Oh, was one of the kids playing? Was he the little kid playing basketball that looked up and noticed the thing in the sky first? With my brain and weapons, they could overthrow every country and Wakanda could rule them all. He drew his weapon on me. <laughs> oh, God. So sad he had to kill his brother. I'm a child. We left him. That's so sad. Yeah, that's true. If you brought him back, it, you'd have to explain to the people why you brought him back and who he was. Ugh. Oh, God. Oh, my God. He got here fast. Is he bringing Klaus' body here? Oh, my God. I'm concerned that this guy is going to start to trust, like, Michael B. Jordan's character more than his friend, the king, because he was able to bring him Klaus. I'm a little concerned. So I guess that's why he did it, to earn favor with the Wakandan people. A man showed up at the border who claims to have killed Klaus. An outsider. No, a Wakandan. He's not a Wakandan. He's one of ours. Uh, see, this is where it's helpful to have this guy around. He's like, oh, I know who that is. He's American. He's also still Wakandan, but just by blood. Started calling him Killmonger. He really has killed a lot of people. Wow, this is his cousin. This is crazy. I want the throne. It's about two billion people all over the world that looks like us. Wakanda has the tools to liberate them all. Ah, uh, he passed that ideology onto his son, which I understand. Take him away. Oh, you can't silence him. He's gonna say who he is. Indingu and Tadaka! Oh no, his friend is, oh no, his friend is, is conflicted too. This is so bad. I'm exercising my blood right. The challenge for the mantles of King and Black Panther. Oh wow. Oh, this is bad. This is crazy, man. Oh, I'm so concerned for him. I feel like this isn't gonna go well. I'm worried, honestly. The King will now have the strength of the Black Panther stripped away. Oh God. Wait, so that takes away the, oh, that takes away the power. I know he said that before, but I'm glad we're repeating it. This is bad, guys. I really don't, I don't have faith. I don't have faith. Michael Jordan's character scares me. I live my entire life waiting for this moment. Yeah, I have a feeling he's gonna smoke you. I'm so scared. Oh my God, his whole body's covered? Oh my God, he's killed so many people. Just so I could kill you. Oh God, you guys, this is so bad. I don't think this is gonna go well. We're too early on in the movie for this to go well. This is definitely not the final climax. Oh my God, oh no. This is for my father. I am the cause of your father's death. Take me. I'll take you both, Uncle James. Oh, no. oh. is he gonna throw him over the edge of the waterfall? Oh my God. I mean, he's not gonna die though. He's not gonna die. I just don't, I just don't know what's gonna happen now. Like how the f is he supposed to come back from this? Oh no, oh no. And she's gotta follow orders. They've gotta follow orders from him now and they don't want to, or she doesn't want to at least. Oh, this is so sad. Oh God, they're about to put him through the ritual. Is this gonna work? Like what's gonna happen here? I can't imagine this working well for him, but oh boy, I wanna see him in the ancestral plane. I feel so bad because I see where his motivations lie and wanting to help people people who need it, who, who are less fortunate, especially when you see your country not doing what they need to do. But it's like, it's also, it's just a complex situation and giving everybody access to vibranium is not gonna fix the problem. God, this is the ancestral plane for him. Is there no one here for him? There's no Panthers. What did I tell you about going into my things? Hmm? Whoa. Wow, it's so interesting. He went back to being a little kid. I really empathize with him because he's still just a little kid and he's been put through so much, but what he's after is not gonna fix things. Oh God, is Nakia here? So when it comes time for another king, we will be ready. Oh no. Another king. Yeah, like you're gonna die one day. Yeah, go ahead and burn all that. No. It is our tradition. <laughs> 
Oh no. She's gonna save one. Good job. Good job, girl. Oh God. He's trying to ruin all their traditions. Thank God she saved one. I don't like this. The herb belongs to us. We may be creating a bigger monster with Imbaku. Oh. Oh, wow. They're going to the fifth tribe. The Jabari. This is crazy, man. I never thought... I really didn't think they'd be working with these people. Let me tell you. Completely forgot about them, to be honest. My son. What? Was married. Oh, oh. This is why we are here. She only has one of those. This is so crazy. T'Challa's not dead, right? I really don't think he is. I think he's gonna come back somehow, but we haven't seen him. Come with me. Is this what's gonna reunite the five tribes? <gasps> Impossible. He's alive, isn't he? hey -o! Nakia, the app. Is that gonna heal him? Wow, that's so honest of M'Baku to, to bring them to him when he could have taken the herb for himself. I like M'Baku now. That's really honest of him. That's interesting, instead of sand, now it's snow. I'm not really sure that snow would help him with a coma, but all right. The time has come for you to come home. No, no it's not. All of you are wrong to turn your backs on the rest of the world. Oh, wow. He's gonna come to Nakia's way of thinking. He's gotta find that middle ground, you know? Can't do what Michael B. Jordan wants, but maybe more of what Nakia wants. Uh, you have a blanket. Ah, uh, <laughs> you're so fine. Oh, that's his suit, right? The necklace is in the suit. The suit is in the necklace, right? Doesn't Michael B. Jordan now have the powers of the Black Panther also? You know I could use an army as well. We will not help you. I have a feeling they will. I have a feeling they will, but later in the movie, they're gonna come in at a critical moment. It's probably what's gonna happen. Right when all seems hopeless and you think Michael B. Jordan might just win, the Jabari will come in. But the war dogs in London, New York, and Hong Kong are standing by. London, New York, and Hong Kong, exactly where the spiritual centers are from the Doctor Strange movie. Oh, he just stopped it literally by himself. Wow. He lives. Yes, he lives. What's up? What's up? I am not dead! That's true, he didn't give him the option to yield. Get those blades in the air! Can't no, stop! Stop! Oh, really? You wouldn't think that they'd all hes- some of them would hesitate. Wakabi. Wakabi, that's his the name. The challenge is not complete. That's true, it's not Wakabi. Don't fight your friend. Oh, this is so sad. I wouldn't- I'd be like, I'm not a part of the border tribe anymore if this is the option. Oh, there's a the second panther, oh boy. Oh my god, I don't want these women, especially Okoye, to die. It's interesting, the border tribe is on Michael B. Jordan's side, but the- his women are on his side, it's interesting. Stop fighting your friend, man. I will say, I think those blankets are slowing you guys of the border tribe down. What does that mean? What is he doing? Oh my god, he has multiple rhinos! Not just one! What is up? His friend is so long gone. His friend is lost, man. Although that would never work in real life. Like, rhinos are not gonna be that targeted and just be able to knock out certain people. They're gonna be angry and blind in their hatred. They have horrible vision, too. Good luck, Agent Ross! Yeah, I, I don't know what I'm We're doing. We're counting on you! We're counting on you! And he's like, I don't know how this works. <laughs> System activated. Oh, here you go. Sit in the chair, man. I made it American style for you. I made it American style for you. Oh my God. He's like, all right, I'll figure it out. <laughs> oh God. You'll never be a true king. <laughs> yes. Oh, thank God. Thank God. Oh Jesus. What a way to fall. Oh my God. They're fighting in the air. Are you serious? <laughs> oh no. Are they going to break the, the bridge? Come on, dude. The lab is under attack. Oh, the lab. Put me back in. What? Is he sacrificing himself right now? Because it, he knows that the cause is important? Is he seriously sacrificing himself? This guy's so boss. He saved Nakia and now he's gonna sacrifice himself for the sake of the world? Holy oh, oh, oh. <gasps> The Javari are here, huh? I knew it, I knew it. Oh, their women are pretty badass too, all right. It's too late for him, I'm, f I'm afraid. Oh my God, maybe it's not too late for him. Maybe he will survive. I really thought he was gonna die. <gasps> How did she stop it? Oh, cause it likes her. Because they're dating, right? And they're fighting each other. I didn't think about that. The fact that they like love each other. This is f***ed up. Would you kill me, my love? I'm sure she would now. Without question. This is just so sad to watch them all fight each other. It's like you're really fighting for this king who is so awful. I love that the rhino stopped to give her a kiss. He was like, oh, not you. I don't want to hurt you. 
Holy crap. He penetrated it right before it turned back into his suit. Oh my God. My <sighs> pop said Wakanda was the most beautiful thing you ever seen. Kid from Oakland running around believing in fairy tales. I really do empathize with this character, but he just went too far to the dark side, you know? Like, you can't choose the path of violence. It's not always, it's not the right way. Is he gonna survive? Oh, he's, t oh no, he's gonna die, but he's just, he's gonna show him the sunset. Ah! Just bury me in the ocean with my ancestors that jumped from the ships because they knew death was better than bondage. Uh, and, we're, and we don't, I don't think we had, there's no second Black Panther movie. I would have been so curious to see what he did as king, you know, knowing what he knows now and after learning that Wakanda shouldn't hide access to some of this stuff. They need to help their people more. Yeah, it's sad. It was my duty to fight for what I love. Mm, she's admitting it. I can't blame me. I almost died. <laughs> yeah, why are you guys exes again? Just because she wants a different life? I think I know a way you can still if I feel your calling. Oh? How? What did you come up with for her? We're back to this homemade basketball hoop. Why are we back here in Oakland? I bought this building. And that's a building. Is he going to renovate the block? Is he going to renovate the neighborhood? This will be the first Wakanda International Outreach Center. Oh. What? Wait, you can't just do like this without people freaking out, though. Showing the spaceship off like that just seemed unnecessary. <laughs> With all due respect, King T'Challa. What can a nation of farmers have to offer the rest wow, of the world? Wow, that's... Okay, first of all, farmers are incredibly necessary, dude. And they're not farmers. <laughs> are you playing around with that man again? What man? Oh, is it Bucky? Did they pull him out of ice? Oh my god! They pulled him out of the ice! Wow, this movie was another great example of a movie where things aren't so black and white. There's a lot of nuance and a lot of conflict in terms of how I feel. It's not like one of those superhero movies where I'm just like, you're evil, you're good. I can easily root for one cause versus the other. I definitely really empathized with Michael B. Jordan's character a lot because I see his pain. I see where he's coming from, but he definitely was going about it the wrong way by trying to release weapons on the world and force uprisings to take place. Um, that's not the right way to handle a situation, but I understand his frustrations. And I also understand why Wakanda in this story did what they did and hid their technology and vibranium from the rest of the world. It definitely makes sense to me because my inclination would probably be to do the same if I didn't feel like I could help in a way that would also protect my country. So it's it's tough, but I do think it makes sense that they're being open and honest and sharing what they have with the world now because also with technology, it's just so hard to hide that continuously, you know, with smartphones and the internet and things like that. And it's probably best to just try to get ahead of it and share it in a helpful, controlled kind of way. But I'll be interested to see if we ever hear more about this kind of thing in future Marvel movies because I don't think we have any other Black Panther movies left. Let me check real quick. Yeah, there's no other Black Panther movies. I think we'll see him in the next Avengers movie for sure and probably Endgame, but I don't know how much we're gonna get resolved in terms of this storyline if we're gonna see how Wakanda's relationship with the world progresses over time or not. I do know that there's a new series called The Falcon and the Winter Soldier, and I know we're gonna get more of Bucky, so maybe we'll see some of these characters again in another storyline where it's focused on a different character, but we'll get some answers in terms of that. This universe is ever expanding and it's kind of hard for me to follow at this point because I've been watching these movies so close together. It takes a while to learn all this stuff and retain it. My memory is really not the best, so that's been tough for me to work on because my, my memory is just not great. It's definitely getting a little more complicated as the universe expands and we meet more people and we see the complexities of their relationships play out. But I'm enjoying that. I'm enjoying that depth that we're getting, that I'm starting to understand people's backstories a lot more and starting to see their relationships over time. Seeing characters like Ross again, Bucky in the end credit scene, and um, just have a better understanding for Black Panther as a character and his relationships with people in his life. Really like his sister Shuri a lot. Letitia Wright did a great job with that character. She's fun, I like her. Costumes were really incredible as well. Music design was really cool, really fun. All in all, I really liked this movie and I had a great time watching it with you guys here for the first time. 
Yeah, this world uh, is definitely getting pretty expansive and I'm definitely discovering more and more characters that I really empathize with and that I feel myself drawn to. T'Challa is definitely one of them now and I can't wait to meet some more characters with you guys. We only have a few movies left here for Marvel and then we do have things like WandaVision. I know that the X-Men series, if I'm not mistaken, is also part of Marvel technically, just not in the same way they don't overlap at all so we'll definitely have more superhero things to dive into on my channel when we wrap out these films it's not going to be the end of of that kind of stuff but yeah we're catching up here pretty quickly and uh i'll probably finish marvel before black widow comes out and i'm very excited for that because i do love me some scarlett johansson but until the next one that is all i have for you guys in this video so if you liked it please give this video a thumbs up because it really helps me out and lets me know that you guys like this kind of content let me know your thoughts in the comments down below and anything else you might like me to watch next and subscribe if you want to until the next one stay golden bye